what's up everyone welcome back to this channel so in this video i'm going to be saying why is the tundra value or all other cars and truck and things like that um rising in value like very high especially my 2021 toyota tundra but i saw some posts in facebook that somebody said a 2021 toyota tundra for uh, it has like 17,000 miles and it was so i mean selling for like about um sixty four thousand dollars sixty four thousand dollars for a 2021 toyota thunder that has seventeen thousand miles <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to be talking inside the Tundra. Um, I think that, that my neighbors has camera. So now I'm kind of nervous. I'm uh, trying to talk around vlogging like normal because, yeah, because I just noticed he has camera and well, I think those are camera. Yeah, definitely they are. That's why I'm kind of nervous talking now because they will see me. And yeah, I mean, we do have camera like you can see. Sometimes I come out in front of the camera right here uh yeah we do have camera too but i'm most more nervous for the neighbor's camera i know they're not like watching me and things like that but i'm kind of nervous standing in different camera but yeah so that's why i'm inside the tundra right now Whoo! yeah um yeah so yeah the tundra is rising value mostly some cars too and trucks um mostly this one so this the tundra is one of those trucks that that rises in value and everything like that but um so yeah just like i said for the facebook post uh, i just saw this and i was pretty shocked and yeah we got scammed from the dealer like for this truck like they put us a offer or something like that and we got scammed from the dealer and for this truck so we are paying extra and yeah maybe i will do this in the next video about a scam or something else maybe i don't know um but um yeah it is rising in value right so yeah so reason number one is because of microchip shortage um so this thing is affecting mostly like most cars especially for the tundra 2021 um so yeah there's like a shortage and that's why the tundra is rising in value like more and more um so they say just because covid19 pandemic uh many factory closed with it and everything like that so that's probably the main reason why and they need more supplies and things like that without this microchip uh like everything can rise in value which can be very bad maybe this mostly the reason why Ooh, what kind of car is that wait that's a honda i thought it was a different car so um they say that i mean not they i said that maybe because the tundra uh 2021 is pretty much the last v8 they will make after this it will be v6 and mostly some people like most people love v8 you can hear the sound it has so much power but i have respect for the v6 because i mean it's a v6 it, does, it won't sound i mean i don't know if it will sound great but um it's a v6 uh turbo charge and um, supercharged turbo charge i think turbo charge uh yeah so it's a v6 i don't know if it will sound good or not but I have a lot of respect with it. It could have more power than a 2021, but people love the older generation for some reason, like more, but that's why it's getting more rare, expensive. So yeah, um, that's another reason why is it getting expensive and everything like that. Um, The microchip and the last V8, yeah, the last V8. Um, And there's a, not another reason why, to be honest so uh we were choosing like saying let's buy a ford f-150 um and let's buy a ford raptor or something like that but um uh, i saw a lot of problems and things like that and review videos and everything like that but so we said no no ford f-150 no ford 
I mean, Ford are good. Like they're good trucks and cars and everything like that. But um, but but we was choosing something different, like something good and things like that. I thought that was a police, to be honest. Ha, <laughs> that's very funny. Okay, but yeah, um, um, so we didn't choose Ford. Then we we was looking for Dodge and things like that. We didn't bought it. Then I came on the Cybertruck, like, and remember that was 2019, but, or more late, uh, more before, but the Cybertruck came out and everything like that, right? So I said, wow, that Cybertruck is like, that Tesla Cybertruck looks so different. Like everyone will look at us and everything like that. But the thing is that we almost bought it. Like we was like probably 70, 70% 70 uh, sure that we will buy it. But until they delayed and everything like that, because I'm like, we were about sure that we will buy the Cybertruck and everything like that. Like the $69,000 Cybertruck and probably the self-driving but we didn't bother it because the delay and things like that and we didn't want to wait and we had like a lot of projects for our house so so the last option came was a 2021 toyota tundra or the 2021 toyota tacoma and yeah we chose that 2021 toyota tundra and yeah, that's how we bought this truck and everything like that. And probably I will make a video how they scam us. And we have another video that there's a little bump right there, up there, like outside. Probably the next video or something like that. I have no idea. But we bought it like this truck because it holds a value. We driven, I mean, we didn't drive it one. We drove a, I think 1997 Toyota Tacoma and was pretty nice um but yeah so yeah um so yeah we bought this one because mostly it holds the price it's a Toyota is it will last a lot if we if we it will last a lot if we uh, take care of it like good because yeah but yeah we made a great decision and that's why yeah oh yeah I wonder how what that neighbor's thinking right now, but yeah, it holds it holds its value, its V eight value. Let me open this. How you open this? Well, how you open the hood? I forgot how to open it. Hmm. Huh. Wait, I forgot how to open the hood. How you open it? I used to, oh, it's right here, it's right here. Remember guys, it's right here. I'm gonna leave it open just in case. Okay. What's the thing, heavy, how much? Whoa, it's been long that we didn't open this thing. Like, whoa. What's that? So yeah, the mostly the main reason why is it increasing price? Mostly because of this. I mean not mostly, the second mostly uh reason. Goodbye V8, you'll be missed. I mean not this one but um for most the V8 you'll be missed and the V8 will be in our hearts and there's somebody watching me.
I'm super weak on closing this hood, even though it's like very lightweight and everything. But yeah, that's it for today's video. It was pretty fast making a video, but yeah, um, that's it for today's video. And sorry for the bad quality and everything like that, uh, because my phone died. And yeah, oof. You can see the Christmas light is very nice. Okay, so um, yeah. So like, subscribe, turn the notification bell on. And thanks for watching. Goodbye. And see you next time, next week, Sunday. Goodbye.